Okay, here's the custom 951 four post on a stand. There's your control panel. These are on temporary casters. It'll be five, six inches lower once it's off of those. Here's your top heat control. Here's your bottom heat control. This is where your timer is controlled. You have two activate buttons that you have to press at the same time. And uh, when pressed, if you let go, the machine will just come right back up. So it does require a twin hand activate during the closure of the press. Once it's actually applying pressure, it will remain closed and uh, activate the timer. So that's full stroke, 12 inches stroke. It thinks it's pressing against something because it reached its final stroke, so it is timing down. And at the end of the timing signal, it'll come back up. Well, that's tiny. pressure cylinder and the tooling uh, locations for the threaded tooling and that panel of course will be enclosed once we're finished uh, testing and configuring.